Hello, good afternoon. And my parents, Geraldine, Santiago, and me, I will be presenting the three products we made, the mind map, the conceptual map, and the brochure on global warming, and this is relationship themes. Uh, global warming in the map, the different environmental problems around the global warming organized. At first, climate change, greenhouse gases, extreme meteorological phenomena, impacts on the ecosystems and biodiversity, then a rise in the sea level, impacts on the public health. In each of sea problems, I will be expanding in the following of conceptual map. Well, what we are looking at next is a concept map about global warming. Okay, what is a global warming? Um, gradual in increase in the temperature of the atmosphere, land, and oceans. Uh, these problems are caused by burning of fossil fuels, deforestation, agriculture, and livestock, waste and um, wastewater treatment, use of chemical products, and uh, industry. Uh, what impact has this issue uh, had on ecosystems and biodiversity around the world? Uh, the industry, um, air and water pollution affecting the health of ecosystems and their inhabitants. inhabitants. Uh, use of chemical products and uh, damage uh, to the ozone layer, impacting the health of marine and terrestrial biodiversity. Uh, waste and wastewater treatment, uh, soil and water pollution, treating uh, wildlife in an aquatic ecosystem. Mm. For the left, please. Um, um, the impact um, of burning of fossil fuels uh, increase global temperatures, um, melting glaciers, and changes in rainfall patterns. Uh, deforestation, loss of natural habitats, decrease in biodiversity, and increase uh, risk of species extinction. And water and soil pollution, loss of local biodiversity, and contribution to climate change. Um, what is a possible solution for this? Um, for the burning of fossil fuels, uh, promote to promote the use of renewable, renewable uh, energy resources like solar, wind, and hydroelectric power and improve energy efficiency across all sectors. Um, for the uh, deforestation, implement reforestation and forest conservation policies and promote sustainable agriculture practice uh, that prevent tree cutting. cutting. Uh, for the agriculture and livestock, uh, encourage sustainable agriculture practice such as ag agroecology and improve livestock waste management to reduce methane emissions. For uh, the um, other uh, the possible solution for the industry is um develop develop and adopt clean technologies that reduce industrial emissions and promote a circular economy to minimize waste. Mm. For the use of chemical products, regulate and reduce the use of harmful chemicals and promote the use of more eco-friendly and sustainable. Uh, alternatives um, and waste and waste water water treatment um, 
the possible solution is implement more efficient and sustainable waste management systems and improve wastewater treatment infrastructure to reduce pollutions. Okay, continue with my partner, Santiago. Okay. Uh, in this brochure, we are going to see our brochure and we compile the most important information for our, of our maps and about all with a focus on knowledge and awareness. Here in our cover, we can, we want, uh, uh, sorry, we want to share in our brochure the idea of the global warming and its crucial importance to our society and to take meaningful actions to control it. First, first of all, this is our core where we want to remark the phrase, the phrase, every degree matters. Okay, next to this, and please go back, go to the other page, to page number two. Okay. Here we have a very meaningful information. And the first of that is how understanding the global warming, what is global warming? We consider that we consider that like, like the gradual increase in your average surface temperatures caused primarily by human activities, like my last partner says. But also in this brochure we add some important information and this is how it happens. And we consider it important in in four parts. The first part is greenhouse gases, where we explain it, the sunlight absorption, the radiation trapping, the longevity, and impact of the global warming. This part is so important because we explain so much the, the types of problems that we can have too in, with the global warming. We also want to share some information related with the consequences and highlighting three of the most importance that we have in our world. The first of these, the rising sea levels, very important. The more extreme weather that we are experimenting, inclusive in Colombia, Breda, and the ecosystem disruption. Also, we have an important thing in pro of understand more clearly and have more awareness about this topic, we talk about the impact of the global warming over the humans, seeing things like the health risks, risk, like pollution in the respiratory systems, the economic losses, the food and water shortage in the agriculture industry, and what can, and also we have an important part on this, what can we do? What can we do to reduce or mitigate the global warming? We can see practical steps that we can all take to impact over the global warming. For example, reduce the carbon prints, like things my last partner say, use energy efficiency and applicants, and support sustainable practices, like buying products made from sustainable materials, and getting involved, like joining local environmental group of initiatives and participating communities. Also, please go to the first page. Also, we have another options, more another sustainable option, options to mitigate global warming, more big, and this is one of the most important, and it's the renew renewable energy solutions. We can see in the information how it is uh, energy like is emerging like a crucial solutions to mitigate climate change. Source my last partner says the solar, wine, electrical, or geothermal, or geothermal generated electricity. Also, we want to recognize some actions that we, we can take immediately like reduce energy consumption in our houses, in our works, in our industries, etc. cetera, a switch like for the switch to ren renewable energy, use sustainable transport transportation. It's not only the bus, it's not only the taxi, it can be to the bicycle, the bicycle, the electric scooters, etc. electric cars too, electric motorcycles. We can we can have to the conscientious consumption like by local and organic, like I said recently, and the water conservation, and it is very important to collect water for gardening, for for wash cars, et cetera, et cetera. In the topic of awareness, like we are, we were talking, we add something important and some a part important that is stay informed. It's important to stay informed about developments in renewable energy, sustainable practices, and follow reliable sources, join communities, participate in local initiatives, use social media more 
of the procrastination and uses to, to take awareness of the global warming. And finally, we add some, some links that some curious people can, can go. And they see these are NASA climate chains where it explains the climate chains and that does actually act, act, that does actualize it to the, to the world of today. We have to our working data, a page like very similarity of the NASA, and finally National Geographic Climate Change Resource, who have some research, some educational resources. This is more like for teachers or curious people who want to come to share the information that we have here with other persons to share the awareness. And this is all in our contents. Thank you so much.